second exercise is leg press. Uh, this is just a feeder set, what a, what a prep coach calls them. Just doing, doing a few reps just to find the right weight. We're doing three sets of 15, and then we got one set of failure. This is just a little pump. We're not locking out. We're not locking out, so you want to comment on our form, then I repeat, we are not locking out. <laughs> Here we go, first working set. Sixth place, going 15 reps. Let's talk about feet placement. On these, we are doing feet close together, as you can see. And about halfway, about midpoint on the platform. See how close the feet are together? All right. Different feet placements work different parts of the quad. So close together, we work on that outer quad, that sweep. So we're doing 15 reps. Now if you want to work the inner, he will spread his feet. It makes it more difficult when you bring it down a little lower on the pad, the feet pressing as well. Easy money. All right, first set. Leg press, got eight plates on there. Once again, notice feet placement, notice total weight movement, not locking out, just keeping that constant tension on the muscle. A lot of y'all may be like, why are you not locking out? Well, number one, the key to the tension is the blood flow. Get as much blood in there as possible. Still keeping good, clean rep, good clean form as you saw for 15. Woo! Set number one complete. All right, moving on to the third set. Going up a little bit. Uh, same feet placement, same rep range. 15 reps. Same motion, no lockout. It's just pumping. Controlled, controlled though. Even though we pumping, man, not locking out, we still want to control the weight. No, no slinging around, no bouncing, none of that. Still control movement. All right, this is set number three. As you can tell, we put them in weight moderately, progressively. Still getting your reps, man. That's one thing. Live for reps. You wanna make sure you get all them in. No ego lifting when it comes to bodybuilding. <laughs> set. There we go. This is our finisher set. Kept the weight the same. We're just going to get as many reps as we can. Four, pump. No rest. Well, you can rest on these. You can rest, pause if you need to. Just want to get as many reps as you can go. F word in here. Pump, 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 pump. Rest pause. All 
All right, so we got last set on here. I'm a weightlifter. Yeah. Talk yourself up to it, buddy. Uh, we got a, a nine place on each side. Going to fail. Your feet placement the same. Same as the last rep. Nothing different. Once again, going to fail. I don't have for it. No syringe of motion. It's constant pump, constant tension. You need to just go to kick on them. Certified GSC leg day. Feeling the burn already. Let's go! The well, rest pause actually going here. Get your, get your gumption back up. Rip. Get your gumption in. Pump. There it is. That's the look of failure. All right, we have moved on to leg extensions. I mean, sorry, leg curls, line leg curls. We have, I believe it's three sets of 10, maybe four, and then look. It's on our second set here. Uh, what we're doing, coming all the way up, squeezing. You're going all the way down and actually letting the, the weight stop. Kind of a mini rest pause. So we're coming all the way up, squeezing at the top, and letting the weight come all the way back down to the touches the plates. And then that's it. Squeeze, see that, all the way down. Good set. These are a little harder than they look. It's the wrist pause actually that makes it hard. Once again, same methodology. Hold and pause at the top. Y'all notice a lot of these, people are gonna get the blood into the muscle. Extreme growth, sculpting. I have to come in here and lift the world. You lift your weight, your reps, it's your blood flow. Especially when cutting. You want to get the body shredded. Big as you can, shredded as you can. Pause at the top, hold it. All right, this is our, this is our last lift for the day. We got four sets of eight stiff leg deadlifts. Uh, this week we're only going to about mid shin. See that? Come back up. That's just to keep tension on the hamstring. Last week we went all the way down, working more to stretch. This week we're just keeping that tension, getting that blood, feeling it full of blood, tensioning up, tension our legs. Second step: uh, stiff leg deadlifts. Four sets to eight. Mid shin, keep the tension. Good form, man. On these, keep your back flat. Otherwise, you will pull something. And make sure you're pulling all the weight with your hamstrings. All the weight comes with your hamstrings. So, ladies and gentlemen, that concludes it. Uh, it's like 9.38. Um, today, we did legs. Uh, start with a little 10, 15 minute warm up on the treadmill. And uh, our first exercise we did was squats. Uh, then we went on to leg press. Then we did line leg curls. Then we did stiff leg deadlifts. And I uh, topped it off with an hour of cardio. So um, today's focus, man, was blood pump uh, for growth and tension. And legs are a little bit fried. Uh, signs of a good leg workout. Number one, you have to hobble out the gym. Number two, legs will be sore. What's today? Saturday. So Monday, a lot of swear words when you're walking into work or wherever you walk into. So, But you should feel the soreness later on in the day as well. So, Hey, man, uh, comment on the bottom, man. Shouts out to everybody, man. Appreciate y'all. 
Uh, it's a GSC leg day certified. Time to go home, eat up, and get on with the rest of the day. I'll be easy.